what is going on guys and today I have a wardrobe or closet video whatever you want to call it um dressing room whatever you want to call it this is pretty cool though um I've seen the wardrobes with the armor stands where you just hit a button and it gives you whatever's on that armor stand well what if you want to change it well you gotta do all that and this sort of crap well this you get to pick say I want this armor hat I want these gold boots I want this chest plate and I want these I don't think I picked the pants. I want these pants. So you can just pick whatever you want, however you want to get dressed. Come in here, hit this button, and what do you know? Whatever I picked there. Uh, here we'll do it again. Um, we'll pick these pants, this, this, and that helmet. I don't think I picked a helmet. There. Oh, okay, well let's try it again. <laughs> and boom. What do you know? Whatever I picked. There you go. Um, I do like the ones with the armored stand uh, with your preset already outfits already picked um, but this one's completely customizable you just to fill it up you just come in here and you oh whoops I'm in fly mode there you go and you come in here fill them up one by one well if you're in creative you can do this and well same thing with the other side you just cut these three blocks out or cut these two and then come in here um, but yeah I mean I really enjoy this design it's really simple uh, well it is simple but damn if you're gonna go this in survival it is very expensive look at all these hoppers but I know y'all people that are really smart out there can really make this design a little bit more compact um, so let's go ahead and crack on with the tutorial oh don't mind all that let's go ahead and crack on with the tutorial and I'm gonna show you how guys how to build this okay now to start off we're going to make the foundation so the foundation is going to consist of four sections because there's well there's five different types of armor but um, I don't think you can make chain uh, armor in survival yet I don't know if you can but you know it's just you know I like to keep things even five you know and we're gonna build something like this Oops, take that block there something like this yes you need to keep these separated otherwise if you got a, a button right here then the picture frame right here you don't know what this button is gonna do so that helps keep organization um but also it costs a little bit more hoppers because you need a hopper in the back to make up for that extra space that you made but that's up to you um, this is just a like I said it's a prototype it's something it's just an idea y'all can make this more compact um, just I like the idea of being able to customize it the second you choose what clothes you want to build or the what clothes you want to wear instead of having armor stands um, so now I'm just placing picture frames going along like this we're going to place the buttons on this side too and I'm going to go finish up over here buttons right there and then picture frames right here and more buttons okay so now with actually I forgot to do this part so with this part here you're going to have a dropper facing up drop it right here drop it right here and it's, it's not going to look like this but you need a dropper facing down so we can delete that one right there then you should have something like this. Now to make it to where they all turn on, you need a button right here and you need a piece of resin right here. Yes, it looks kind of tacky, but you know, it works. Um, so now with the bottom droppers for the uh, footwear, you need a dropper facing in. Oh, actually, dropper over there. Then a dropper right here. Oh, drop right there facing in. You're going to need a dropper right here. Right here. You need this dropper facing outward. I can get it facing outward then this dropper facing outward this dropper facing in and then this dropper facing in now let's go do the same thing on the other side we we'll find out where the buttons at buttons over here so it's a little opposite ish and one facing out so if I can just get it out and one facing that way and this one facing out and the one facing this way Okay, now this decision right here is completely yours. Um, uh, well, let's go ahead and look, hook it up, and then I'm gonna show you what I mean. So, we start something like this. Actually, like this. So we're gonna get some hoppers. Go in. Make sure you're holding down shift. That way, you know they're all connected to each other. And then we're gonna come over here and shift, click, click. But make sure you're holding down shift. That way, they are all connected to each other. Just in case some of y'all are new, they're all connected to each other. Um, now what else this is what I was talking about um, as you can hear it that's what you're gonna hear if there's no hopper right here now if it, uh, let me just put an item in here and just put a little test button that's what you're gonna hear 
the hopper's still gonna collect it but I don't know about y'all but I don't wanna be hearing that noise in the morning so if you do have enough resources if you put a hopper right here oh wait did I take the items out yep and let me just keep one oh golly just keep one now uh, if you have a hopper in front of it what the heck <laughs> are these suspensions this dropper okay yeah if you're over here you won't hear it. Um, but now also when it's empty you will hear it but say the hopper still isn't here then you have this right here you'll hear it but like I said you put the hopper right here oh shift click you won't hear it so that's completely up to you guys um, I don't want to hear that so I am definitely going to be keeping a hopper right there um, but they're all connected and I need to get all these out that way we don't have any mess ups um, so yeah there's that we're gonna do it oh well here I guess we'll start with the next section okay so now the next one it is gonna look a little funny but we need to come out too then we just need to come along all oh, whoops, holding down shift going all the way along right here and then shift shift then boom shift and then we gotta jump on in here, and then we gotta do shift, 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 do, 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 boom. So now those are connected up. Now it's good. Okay, and now this is going to look a little tacky right here. Um, <laughs> just bear with me. It's gonna be clicking right here, click right there, and then it's going to be a hopper right here and a hopper right here. Um, now to get this one wired up, you gotta have. Oh, we don't want to connect it like that. We wanna connect it around the back. Gonna be, you're gonna have one right here coming all the way along the back you can go on top right here and like I said if y'all can find a way to make this more compact that'd be great because this is quite expensive if you're in survival um, but it's still also more convenient than having to change out armor stands all the time so that's the reason why I do like this design okay now the top part is really well <laughs> not really it's just it is easier so we have a hop right here then we just want to come along right here oh whoops Keep coming along. Make sure you're holding down shift. And if you're wondering how I'm staying in the air right now, it's because I'm holding down the space bar and shift at the same time. But sometimes I go up because my shift key is starting to break. Okay, so now all that is done, you just have to do the same thing on the other side. So I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick. Okay, now that you have it all wired up, here's what you got to do. So now you have to put all the helmet wear at the top. So let me just, let me just show you how to fill up one of them. I'm not going to fill them all up. But uh, let's see. Oh, I guess you can do this. Make sure they all work. Hear that? Hear that? Hear that? You just go through. You can test them all out. But they will work as long as you follow it step by step. Let's see. Let's go ahead and chunk in our diamond right here. <laughs> I couldn't imagine y'all filling this thing up with diamond. But um, if you do have the barrier right here, whatever you decided to put for the barrier, go ahead and take out. Well, you can take out just those two blocks and jump on. Well, jump on in here and start with the bottom if you want to and just go ahead and fill that up um, if you're wondering how I'm do this most of y'all might not know but if you hit the middle click whenever you're hovering above it there you go um, and then go ahead and do this now I'm not going to do this for everyone like I just said because I already showed you that it works I just showed you how to build it but we're just going to do this as a test wait why am I filling them all up then I'm such an idiot <laughs> I'm just going to put one of them in it and then that okay so now we can go ahead and select them all nice and quiet just hear button clicks then we come on in here oh you, my bad I forgot to tell y'all to cover this up and then you just hit this boom and I already had huh that is awkward why did that not go on me that is so weird oh oh nope whoops guys yep I forgot you gotta put dispensers right here that's what the difference is you gotta have dispensers Yep, don't forget that part. Dispensers. <laughs> that was my fault. So my fault. Okay, now we're gonna put the button right there. Get some red so. I was wondering like I was like, oh, I thought it worked. Okay, so well as you see we already ran out. Well actually. Three, two, three. Okay, so let's see what do we run out of let's say. Run out of this. Put two in there just in case. 
All right, so now let's go ahead and select all these again. All right, give them some time, and then walk on in here. And then, and I should be wearing everything. Yes, I am wearing everything. And uh, like I said, you can pick whatever you want. Like if you're feeling, if you want just pants, you can have just pants. Um, it's not a complete thing. So it's fully, it's fully like, that's it. You don't like, you don't. I've seen it. Like I said, I've seen the designs with the armor stands, and you can have the armor stands, and you just customize the armor stands to how you want. Yes, it's a little bit less expensive, but. I mean, I don't know about y'all, but I don't like to wear the same clothes every day. This, you can pick whatever you want to wear. Um, but, you know, the armor stands so are good. I mean, me, when I'm in survival, I just stick with iron because iron's all I can find because I don't find too many diamonds. But, oh, well, it, that, that's just me. Anyway, guys, if this video was helpful, please give a like. And if you enjoyed it, please subscribe. Uh, and also, give me some ideas. Um, I'm kind of struggling on ideas to come up with. I mean, uh, my testing world is kind of short right now, but if you want to know what this is, I already posted a video on that one, that is the Super Smelter design, um, that, well that's just a different design, um, but yeah, if you really enjoyed this guys, please leave a like, also subscribe, and thank you.